Uh, hi students, uh, today we will discuss about the one of the important question of in short purpose meeting. So define a meeting. Meeting means uh, two or more members, uh, two or more persons get together at one place to discuss any common issue or common matter. It is called as a meeting. So meeting means into the two or more members in gathering one place. It can be discussed about the in any matter or any issue. So the business of the company is carried on by the selected representatives of the members. So company it can be uh, selected by the representative members. It is called as the indirector. The director take decisions by calling their meeting. So uh, directors on a person saying it can be decisions are taken by the in meeting. There are also in certain matters which are to be decided by the whole body of shareholders of the company. So it can be decided by the in meeting in a whole body. So of the shareholders in the company. The shareholders also decided the matters by calling their meeting from the time to time. So shareholders that can be calling to the in some matters. It can be in a meeting purpose in time to time. A meeting may be defined as a gathering or assembling of the in number of persons. So meeting means it can be assembly. Uh, it can be assembly in a gather to the in number of persons for transacting any lawful business. So it is also in any lawful business. It may be noted that every gathering of person does not constitute a meeting. So it can be uh, gather the persons and does not constitute a meeting. A meeting to be valid if uh, it is held by the following in prescribed rules and regulations. The company meeting to be invalid must be in converted and held as per the provisions of in companies act in previous 1956 in present uh, companies act 2013 and rules framed uh, there under the matters are decided by passing the in resolution at the meeting so the matters that can be in passed to the in resolution meetings also in thanks for watching Chinese short question in